Welcome to the channel. Welcome to Blue Chelsea TV. Celtic fired four past Chelsea to leave Enzo Maresca still looking for his first win as Blue's boss. Chelsea started brightly but were soon put on the back foot by Brendan Rodgers' side. Celtic, who were playing their fifth game of preseason compared to Chelsea's second, took the lead through Matt O'Reilly. The Scottish champions were finding plenty of space on the break behind the Blues' high line but their second came from a short corner point three simple passes allowed O'Reilly to tee up Furuhashi Kyogo to tap in at the far post. Chelsea were vastly improved after the break but collapsed late on in the second half. Take a moment to like the video if you are enjoying the content. Subscribe to the channel if you are bumping here for the very first time. A howler from Benoit Badiashile saw him play the ball straight to the feet of Luis Palma as Chelsea tried to play out, with the no-7 turning and finishing. There was a second goal in two minutes as another ball over the top caught the Blues out. Mikey Johnston racing in behind and making it forward, Sterling won a late penalty to give the American Chelsea fans something to shout about, which was converted by Christopher Nkunku. Here's my ratings for one of the most horrible preseason matches I've seen Chelsea play in years. Robert Sanchez, 6 despite conceding and looking a little shaky on the ball at times the Spaniard made some fine saves, including one superb stop from Kyogo in the first half. Put Beatty Ashile in trouble leading up to his mistake for the third goal. Reese James, 6 still getting used to his new inverted role which involves a lot of work when changing positions. Chelsea were left exposed by it at times, but he still looked good on the ball, not quite as impactful as against Wrexham. Wesley Fofana. Six looked a threat from set pieces, but still looks a way off being back to full fitness after such a long spell out with injury. This was his first start in more than a year. Benoit Badiashile. For an absolute shocker for the third Celtic goal, sending a pass backwards straight to the feet of Palma. Had been good going forwards on the ball before that, but a real moment to forget. Levi Colwill, five no fights this time, but could have done with a bit more aggression against Celtic in the first half as they raced in behind time and again. Romeo Lavia, six some fine turns on the ball in midfield to get Chelsea going. Confident and strong when it comes to holding off opposing players more encouraging minutes after making just one appearance in his first season. Carney Chukwamika, five lots of hustle and bustle, but lacked a clinical touch when it mattered, tried to make things happen when Chelsea were struggling point one of three taken off at the break having been the only player to play the full 90 minutes against Wrexham. Noni Maduk, six electric pace down the right at times and got the better of his fullback on plenty of occasions. However, reliance on his left foot meant the winger fluffed a superb chance when trying to sort out his feet from Sterling's. Cutback. Christopher Nkunku, 7-2 goals in two preseason games, his penalty adding to the opener against Wrexham. Looking very sharp as he works towards what will hopefully be a full season for Chelsea. Forced some openings early on with his pace, but faded a touch as the game went on. Mikhaila Mudrick, 5 a couple of flashes on the ball down the left but a very quiet game other than that as his teammates struggled to find him in good positions. Withdrawn at the break. Mark Yu. 7 needs to work on finishing his chances but the young signing led the line exceptionally well and dealt with the rough stuff from the Celtic defenders impressively. Looks like a promising talent. Substitutes. Raheem Sterling. Seven immediately injected life into this Chelsea team and got them on the front foot after the break. Unlucky not to get himself a goal, hitting the post shortly after coming on. Good darting run to win the penalty. Leslie Yugachukwu, six a couple of nice touches and showed plenty of willing to get forwards and run in behind. Tosin Adarabayoyo, Five adventurous stepping out and playing on the ball, but let Johnston go far too easily for Celtic's fourth. Malo Gusto. Five just like James, trying to learn the ropes of his new role but offered very little on the ball and left the defense exposed at times. Andre Santos. Six a few sharp moments on the ball as Chelsea looked to move forwards. Quickly. 
That's all. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. See you later with another video. Until then, goodbye.